moments. I enjoy using the Switch as a Switch. I like those moments where I'm like, hey, you want to play? And then you take the flipple flopples off and you play with half a Joy-Con and then you both complain because of, you know, oh, I only lost because I was using half a Joy-Con. What's going on, guys? Um, I finally, we've had some time to sleep on it. We've had some time to sleep on it, so we had the announcement yesterday. We can finally put up a little bit of a defense. Here's the Nintendrone answer. This is my Nintendrone response. Nintendo never lied to us. Let me see if I can switch this. Which one was it? Scene two? I'm gonna, I'm gonna mess this up. There we go. I was pretty hard on it, but Nintendo never actually lied to us. It wasn't Nintendo who gave us all these expectations. It was all these journalists, the journalists, you know, the ones that can't beat the tutorial and Cuphead, the journalists, they're the ones who keep on preaching this nonsense. They're the reason why our expectations were so bad. So we've had some time to sit on it. And again, you know, I've actually had a decent response. I was actually kind of surprised. Thank you, everybody who participated in that. Uh, I was kind of surprised by the amount of responses and views I've got. I got 19 views on it. That's a big thing. And we got a subscriber. 51, number 51. Welcome to the channel. Thank you. Um, but for real, for real, uh, in their defense, Nintendo didn't lie to us. Nintendo didn't build our hopes up or anything. In fact, Nintendo was pretty straightforward about it the entire time. So, it, you can't really fault Nintendo. If, if anything... Technically, we're getting a slightly better system. It's another option that you can pick up, and that should be a good thing, right? It should be a good thing. Um, I've had my Switch since day one, so that's part of why I'm inevitably going to get this other Switch. I actually wanted to read off some of that, because if I actually got some comments... Can we zoom in? This, this actually makes me really mad because of... Cash Yuppers was the first one to post first, so I don't know why. Maybe it's because there's comments on it. Syringe Suit posted it also. Copacetic media. No, you're not. No, you're not. Y'all need to shut up with this first bullcrap. Shut up. Uh, Nintendo fanboys get baited. Well, actually, that's kind of that's what we're here to talk about. No, Nintendo didn't bait us. The media baited us. This is all the media's fault. That information that was false and fake and never happened. So don't, don't hate on Nintendo. Again, it's gonna be cool. It's just not what we wanted. So moving up to Copacetic Barbarian, one of my biggest supporters of the channel. Appreciate your support and your comments. <sighs> Let's see, don't buy it because you will inevitably do so one day. Oh please, you don't have to buy this, so I really recommend that you don't fork away 350 or however much this thing ends up costing to buy. If you already have the original Switch, come on, it's just a waste of money. Also, thanks for telling me about this. I'm glad, I didn't know, uh, it, it was, it, the video dropped out of nowhere. So I kind of, no problem, no problem. I'm still gonna get it. Break the cycle, buy VR and said. Thanks, Syringe Soup. VR is dead. VR is absolutely dead. You know, it had its shot. Fight me online, loser. Sussy Baka for Wii U only at Home Depot. What the hell? What in God's name is my comment section? It's like you dumped out a flippin' vat of nuclear waste. That's all this is. Copacetic Barbarian, please God tell me this is not the Switch Pro and this is just a minor upgrade. I mean, this is terrible, of course, didn't expect it to have 4K resolution and definitely not 1440p display. I actually talked about this before and I kind of, it's a valid point. I hope, I hope uh, Copacetic's on the same wavelength with me here. Um, there's no point in a 1440 resolution for the Switch. Uh, not, not if there's no upscaling. Absolutely not. It, it has to upscale, period. It would have to upscale to 4K. Because I am one of the few people I know with a 1440 display monitor, but 1440p is absolutely a PC gaming resolution. That's PC gaming basically exclusively. Uh, so, yeah. That should have never even been in the window. Expected more, more useful things, bigger kickstand, that is cool. 
because of uh, that's one of the biggest faults. I enjoy using the Switch as a Switch. I like those moments where I'm like, hey, you want to play? And then you take the flipple flopples off and you play with half a Joy-Con and then you both complain because of, you know, oh, I only lost because I was using half a Joy-Con. Um, cool stuff. Cool stuff. Uh, and da -da 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 -da. nice video. And welcome back to YouTube. Thank you, Copacetic Barbarian. It's good to be back, man. I'm going to try and just spit out things, even if it's just opinions, ripped, whatever. Um, let's see if I can get this in frame. Syringe Soup here sent me a message. <laughs> it's not going to focus on it. Uh, point being, it says, I'm tempted to rip off your video. Rip it off. Rip it off. It's Syringe Soup's the kind of guy who doesn't understand Boku Watobi, so basically, you do you. Mother trucker. Anyways, guys, point being, Nintendo didn't let us down. Nintendo didn't let us down. The world around us let us down. So, this is kind of a nothing video. Anyways, y'all have a great day, and uh, I'll talk to you later. 8-Bit Bird out.